Okay guys, another interesting tech news update. Let's start with the Samsung Galaxy Note 20. So apart from the usual specs bump, I'm actually interested in what the S Pen could do more than it already does so many good things. From the images leaked so far, uh, okay, just a couple of images, I think the S Pen will have an additional button or say switch sort of thing that can be customized say to change the brush or quickly launch applications while browsing or maybe quickly open an app in a pop-up window that sort of thing but i do see a little button over there let's wait and see so what kind of changes do you guys like to see in s pen let me know in the comment section down below also the camera array seems interesting here with no confirmed spec reveal yet maybe 108 megapixel sensor not sure also you can see the periscope zoom camera with that third camera at the bottom which means whatever megapixel or resolution the camera gets it it will be like able to take lossless zoom pictures say 10x or 20x lossless zoom so only time will tell how much zoom the display is now bezel less almost and it's also very thin meaning you won't see huge battery capacity upgrade over here the power and volume key this time will be on the right side whereas the s pen and downwards firing speaker on the left bottom side of the phone so guys are you like looking forward to the launch your thoughts in the comment section down below and moving on okay some interesting thing here lenovo is doing it's bringing some new stuff to the table to the mobile gaming enthusiasts and customers or rather consumers who look something more in terms of performance and battery capacity the lenovo legion gaming mobile phone you might have already heard about this but the main focus here is to make use of landscape mode with the flagship specs of course the interesting thing here is it gets overclocked current flagship processor which means snapdragon 865 plus maybe which is like overclocked to over 3 gigahertz usually 2.8 gigahertz also with the gpu clocked over 13 percent than usual meaning you get that cpu as well as gpu bump up with specs like overclocked edition and you can expect little bit of boost in terms of performance also rumored to feature is a 90 watt fast charger which is insane in my opinion a dual linear vibration motor to experience that gaming thrill and two usb-c ports only time will tell i think with the two usb-c ports you can like connect the joystick and use it very conveniently that's something interesting in terms of how companies are finding ways to deliver something new to the consumers with slight but interesting changes right guys now if you have been using instagram and get lots of comments now you can pin three comments to the top of the post comment like uh, you can give it a try this feature was actually available uh, like it already existed since may for some users but now it is rolling to everybody so you can just go ahead and check the instagram comments and you can pin the comments above this feature is to like improve authors to highlight positive replies and moderate negative or abusive ones right so oneplus on other hand is busy with its incoming launch of the oneplus nord okay i just say it's the market hype nothing interesting here except the name itself the nord it's just the usual 48 megapixel that has a optical image stabilization okay nothing new here it has a boring 5 megapixel macro no telephoto lens 8 megapixel ultra wide 2 megapixel depth sensor again boring it comes with a snapdragon 765g chipset which is like flagship mid-range chipset 6 gb 128 gb ram and storage respectively and probably a 4300 milliampere hour battery the pricing could be around 30,000 Indian rupees, which is quite expensive considering there are literally so many other phones in the market now at a very lesser price, right? So you see there is nothing interesting except the name itself, that's the OnePlus Nord. So are you guys excited about this device? Leave a comment uh, down below. Uh, so guys, that's it in this video. I hope uh, you liked it. Give this video a thumbs up. Just a brief video on letting you know what's going on in the tech world, like what are the new launches. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.